Hi. Star Stable posted about the character update on their blog again. As always, I just wanted to talk about it and give you more information about what we can expect. This blog post tells us what they already did and how they are working on the animations. We also got a picture which is another hint that we'll get large pets in the game. I hope you are interested and now let's start. As Star Stable said, this month they wanted to dive a bit more into the technical aspect of the character update. Their main focus are on diversity and inclusivity, that's why they firstly focused on the skin color, body shapes and hair. They also told us how hard it is to add so many skin colors. All textures in Star Stable are hand-painted, and they had to experiment with painting highlights in a lot of different ways. It's also hard to make them not look too shiny during the day, or too dark at night. It seems like they are happy with the progress, and they will also add more lighting updates in the future. What this could mean? Well, for example that the horse isn't dark in the arena with lights. This is something that needs to be fixed soon, it looks really wrong in my opinion. The animations, which are the most exciting for me. Star Stable said, that luckily they can adapt the same animations onto different body types. But this doesn't mean, that they look the same. They have to add another layer, that corrects some differences. This is what they call additive animation. Not only it takes much less time to animate the characters this way, it's also better for the game's performance. They also told us that they're still working on fitting all clothes to all body types, which is a really hard part too. As they said, they had positive results so far. Well, for me it sounds like the more they get into the progress, the more they see how much work it actually is. If I would have to estimate the release now, I would say it'll be at the end of the year. There's still so much work that needs to be done, but let's hope they'll actually come out this year. We already know what we can expect from the animations. Firstly, of course more natural positions while sitting on the horse. What I mean by that is just simply that we don't look like a potato when our horses are doing special animations. Another animation that is really needed is the ability to blink. I'm sorry that I have to say this, but without this animation our current characters don't look real at all. Something that I have noticed on newer horse breeds is the characters jumping animation that looks horrible. Another thing I would love to have is to have different animations with and without having a saddle on our horse. Why this is needed? Well, because right now our characters are literally flying in the air without a saddle. And the trot looks like we would have an invisible stirrup. This is something that could be fixed with sitting the trot while riding bareback. We already had so many hints that we'll get large pets, so if you are interested what these things are, check out my video about it. But the picture Star Stable added to this post is another one. I don't want to spread false news, but I'm pretty sure that soon we'll get large pets in the game. What do you think about this? I would love to know your opinion. Since there aren't really other informations we can know about the character update, that's all I can tell you now. I'll make another video about this topic next month, when I know more, so stay tuned. Anyways, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.